Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. This is a, will your person of interest reach out? What is the message please? This is for Scorpio friends out there. This is a special reading for Scorpio. What can I get for Scorpio please? Will their person of interest reach out? What is their current feelings? What can I get for Scorpio? What is the message available for Scorpio to know? What is ready for them to know, okay? Will, will Scorpio's um, person of interest reach out? What's their feelings, please, okay? So in today's reading, Scorpio, I will be starting to um, look at um, um, air sign, okay? If you are dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, that's the first reading. The second reading, Scorpio, is the um, earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. If you're dealing with an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, that is the second reading. And then the third reading, Scorpio, is if you're dealing with a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Venus. What's their feelings towards you? Will they call you? And then you've got the Hierophant, sorry. The last reading is for fire sign, okay? If you're dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, what's their feelings towards you? Will they call you? Um, and of course, before I start, thank you, Scorpio, for coming back. Thanks for tuning in. And guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the subscribe button and the bell, please do it now if you're interested and if you are keen. Oops, sorry. And um, what else? Um, all other offer services that I offer, I keep repeating myself, it is down in the description box below. You know what to do or go to the website. All right, Scorpio, let's start the reading. Okay, let me just ground my energy. Okay. If you're dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Scorpio, that's the first reading. How they're feeling towards you, will they reach out? You've got the Page of Pentacles, the Ten of Wands, the Empress card. Um, how are they feeling towards you? They don't want to fight, okay? They don't want to fight. They don't want to quarrel. Will they reach out to you? Definitely. I see them still wanting to talk to you, to call you, to text you. They don't want complication. They want things, you know, they want things, they want things very simple. They avoid messy fight. They avoid complication. Let's get into it. The devil card. Yeah. Yeah, they don't like argument. They don't like toxicity. And Five of Cups, they don't want to talk about something toxic, something about the past, something about argument. They don't like that. They just really want to build moment with you. They want to have some time with you. They want to talk to you, okay? They don't want to bring the past. They don't want to talk about something that they cannot solve or they're not interested to talk. They just want to be with you. They want to unload the toxic. How they feel towards you is, I don't want toxic. I don't want third-party talk. I don't want messy, you know, messy talk, argument, toxic. I don't want bad vibe. I just want to build a moment with you. That's it, Scorpio. Please, you know, this look, this looks like it's going to beg. Yeah, they're begging. Please, I'm not ready to talk about the past, the third party, nor explain myself. I just, I just want to be with you. That's just a build, build a moment together, okay? The second reading is for Earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. How are they feeling towards you? Will they call you? The full card is in reverse, the two of wands, the nine of swords. They don't want to take a risk right now. The, the way they feel towards you is that it's too risky to move. It's too soon. That's it. You know, it's nine of swords. That's pretty much the plan. Okay, two cards. The high priestess, they will they will get back to you, six of swords. But at the moment, they feel like it's better to stay quiet, to keep their mouth shut. Um, this person is, this person will not take a risk opening up subject or decision making that they're not ready. They're quiet, they're listening, they're observing. They're not a talker, uh, but they definitely have an energy of, I want to go back with you, Scorpio. And I want to learn more. I want to understand you. But, you know, it's a, it's a time off. Like, 
Because the Six of Swords in reverse, they're probably moving on or ignoring you or giving you an aloof or cold shoulder. But they will be back. But they want to be silent or silent or something to do with... I want to be quiet, you know, like, leave me alone. I want to think, <laughs> High Priestess. So give this time because they'll eventually come back. When they no longer hear from you, that's where this person is going to start to worry and they will come back. It's needing a time to process something. You know, this person, Earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, they're needing time to process something. So they will be quiet, but they'll get back to you. And then the third reading is that if you're dealing with a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, the Tower card, um, they do not like this person's feeling is, is that they don't like to break up. They don't like the separation. They don't like the idea of breaking up separation or being disconnected with you. They're not happy with the breakup with the, this person, they're not happy with the breakup or with the idea of breaking up or disconnecting with you. They don't like the idea that you guys are disconnected or you will break up. They don't like that. For them, um, if things are not, for them, if things are not working, you just cool off, but you stay. You stay at the same room, at the same place. You don't break up. You don't disconnect. You you just keep it cool. Yeah, Knight of Wands. The Knight of Swords. Five of Pentacles. What's the Five of Pentacles, please? Okay. All right. So, if you're dealing with a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, if the breakup happens or if the disconnection happened already, they don't like that. If you're in a relationship, they don't like to be disconnected. They don't like to break up. This person will avoid that talk. If you break up or separate, separated or disconnected already, um, this person would probably, if you're disconnected already, they, they'll probably rest. You know, They'll give you a rest. They'll give you a break. They will give themselves a break. They will recuperate. They will, you know, they will give you a break. They won't. You know, they won't, um, you know, they, they, it's like temporary breakup or temporary separation, but they, they won't move far away. All right. This person, this Cancer Scorpio Pisces, they don't like to be disconnected with you. They don't want to break up with you. If it's happening, if it's going to that, if you somehow disconnected or break up for them, that's temporary. They won't go away far, okay? And they will do everything to, you know, when things are healthy, when things are ready, they will do everything to get you back, all right? So, um, bad or good, you know, I'd rather have bad times with you than good times with someone new. I shall return. I shall return, okay? I really feel like this person, Scorpio, they're very uh, hardworking. They will... They're very hardworking on getting you back. Because I see in here a possible separation, a breakup, or there is a lapse. You know, you could be disconnecting with this person, but for them, that's just temporary. They never see that as a breakup. That's just a cool off, a time off. They always, they will find their way back to you. And they don't go far away, you know, five of pentacles. They will not allow you guys to separate. To be disconnected permanently, you know. The magician card. When they feel like they're losing hope or grip of you, Scorpio, they will they'll do their you know they'll find a way to really restore or for you not to move on. You know, there's, there's something with this person that they will do their best for you not to move on. And then um the last reading is for the fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, and Venus. Um, you've got here the Hierophant, the Nine of Cups. They're not ready to commit or talk to you because they're upset or angry. Or there is still some sort of lingering bad vibe between the two of you. Okay? Ten of Swords. They will talk. They will come forward. Or things will get restored. 
if you guys would start to heal or would one of you would initiate some sort of apology like an admission of the fault i'm really getting like one of you needs to admit or initiate a sorry or let's talk without that someone needs to push the button <clears throat> excuse me someone needs to push the button yeah so they're quite upset they're still very fiery of you so hopefully you guys heal forgive and forget so you guys would because they're still you know the fact that these are all in reverse this means that this person is still affected of you affected of the fight they're still they haven't moved on you know they still have some pain or hurt or bitterness towards you it means they still like you or they still have feelings for you okay so hopefully one of you will make a move because um there's a lot of interest in here all right so this is you, Scorpio. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here. I'll see you soon again, guys. Bye-bye.